Get ready for some 814 fun. We've got such an amazing artist and maker from the 814, Sarah Vogel. Sarah, thanks for coming on. Thanks for having me today. I literally just found out. So Sarah owns the clay cup in town. But she also does watercolor, and you said you're on a Sheets truck. Your work? Yes. So in 2018, Sheets did a pro like a an art project, and they um, did a competition where 11 winners won, Ooh. and our artwork is on tractor trailers. So cool! And will it say Sarah Vogel Art? We'll get to see that. Um, it has a big watercolor on the side and then my face. Oh, so. I love it. How did it, I, I'm sure I've seen it. That's why you look so familiar. Uh, but Sarah, you also do amazing earrings. You create them because you're such an artistic person. Tell me a little bit, this is a little bit of like a quarantine hobby. Yes. A yeah. quarantine hobby. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, in December, I <clears throat> just wanted to make some gifts for friends, and I was like, this is popular and trendy, maybe I'll get some supplies and do it yeah. for fun, and here I am six months later, and I cannot stop. <laughs> oh, honestly, just even looking at them, you can tell there's such an attention to detail, and also, they're all super fun. Like, you, any, any friend you have, you could give these to, and it would be such an amazing gift to receive. So tell us a little bit about <clears throat> how you make them. How long does it take to create one of your earrings? Yeah, so the process is relatively lengthy. Um, there are, are a lot of different steps involved. And first, it's dealing with the clay itself, which is really fun. That's my favorite part because you can, I mix all the colors myself. I don't use colors right out of the... Thing. Yes, so um, you're so, creating these this like personalized clay. Yeah, every color is unique, and then there's so many types of patterns and designs that you can do. Um, you can create canes. Um, that's what this is called, and then you slice it wow. and lay it down and roll it out. And so this was a cane, and then I made a slab out of it. That's so beautiful. And then basically, you take the slab. You take your different cutters, which you can get these on Etsy, Neat. all different ones. Um, and you basically get to cut out Ooh. your earrings from and, the slab. And you post these really fun videos on TikTok and Instagram where you're rolling these out, cutting them. They're a little like sped up. Yeah. You said one of your videos has how many views on TikTok? Over 500,000 views. Oh my goodness. People love to see the process yeah. and behind the scenes. Yeah, um, wow. so I brought some clay that's chopped up, and this is actually translucent clay with a little bit of white. Neat. And then you can drop in like different alcohol inks or even white paint wow. and make different marbles. So that's what made this marble. And then here's a black clay with a white paint. I love how I'm just like amazed. That made, it looks like stone. Yeah, it does look like stone, but it's, it's clay. Yeah. This is amazing. Can we take a look at some of these? Can we go through, maybe get a close-up of all these? So these are little pigs and cows. Super adorable. Oh, they're really personalized. Tell me a little bit about maybe what inspired this. Yeah, so there is a local lady named Katie Eberhart, and she has an Instagram page, and she talks a lot about her chickens <laughs> and a lot of, like, really dedicated followers, you know, <laughs> follow her. And so this whole barnyard series was oh, inspired by her. The barnyard um, like series. Like the dozen eggs. Oh, I love that. Super and, cute. And um, the hens and chicks. Oh, very fun. So. But then also this, like I'm looking at this little mermaid shell pearl. I'm loving that. So you kind of have a little bit for everybody. And even look at the sparkle here. I had a bridal collection that Ooh. I did um, that's perfect for bridesmaids or gifts for people that help at your wedding. Wow. I, I love it so much. Sarah, if people want to find your work, check you out, how do they do it? So if you want to see all the fun videos, <laughs> that's on my Instagram page, which is Sarah Vogel underscore art. I also have an Etsy shop, which is sarahvogelart.etsy.com, and that is where I sell the majority of my work. Yeah, and maybe if we can even see, I'm wearing one of your earrings. I, I purposely didn't wear earrings today because I said, we're going to have Sarah Vogel art. Look at that. And those are I made just from them right up off the table. This cane. Wow, they are? Yep. Super neat. Wow, can't wait to check out more of your work. And also, if you're at TJ Maxx, 
Check her out. Some of her work's been on pillows, he said. Yeah. Um, they sold out, <laughs> but they were there. Oh, they sold yeah, out. Yeah, they did. <laughs> High demand. Sarah, thank you so much for just, we love showcasing makers right here in the 814. Thank Thanks for coming on the show. Check her out at the Clay Cup. And also, you can get these at local stores real quick. Did you mention them? Um, you can get them at Humble and Kind, 3125 Boutique, La Vintage, La Vintage Decor, and Lightning Bug in Holidaysburg. Perfect. Thanks so much for coming thank on you. and check her out.